Hey guys, it's Jason with JC Films. Today I'm going to be showing you guys some test footage with the Zion Crane 2, the GH5, and the Sigma 18 to 35. Check it out. Time can never be your trusted friend or your sworn ally. No, it's the harshest mistress of all. And life is just a chain of moments spent, a thousand hellos and Goodbyes. Maybe a love like ours can leave out its call. I will keep you near. So, after doing some testing with the Zion Crane, here are my thoughts. I'm going to do three of my likes and three of my dislikes. We'll go with likes first. Uh, number one, pan follow mode. It works great, gets really smooth shots. I see myself using this 99% of the time. Number two is the motion time lapse mode. Um, it just opens up a lot of doors when you're doing time lapses and gives you an extra element of motion in there and it's really easy to set up. Number three, I really like the tripod on the bottom. This thing gets a little heavy, so it's really nice just to be able to set it on the ground. So three things I don't like about it, uh, number one, the problem I have with my GH5 and the Sigma 18 to 35 is when I flip it into inverted mode. Uh, the lens is actually a little too long and I can't get fully into inverted mode without the, the crane clipping the end of the lens. Uh, I wish there was a different way to set it up, but I haven't found one yet. Number two is it gets really heavy, um, which is fine because like I said before, it has the tripod so you can set it down. But it, it gets really heavy. Um, and number three, lock mode. I really don't like. Um, I'm sure it'll come in handy at some point, but for me, I probably won't ever use it. And I noticed that when it gets a little off axis one way, the, the gimbal completely starts freaking out and I have to reset it. Add one more thing that I really like here, and that's one of the new firmware updates. If you hit the mode button four times in a row, it auto levels the camera. So if it gets messed up a little bit, you can just click that button four times and it automatically goes right back to its original level position. All right guys, thanks for watching my uh, test shots of the Zion Crane 2. I hope to be doing more stuff on my channel like this in the future. I recently got a drone and I will be doing some drone reviews and I will keep putting out content and edits as I do them. Uh, feel free to like and subscribe my videos, comment, and uh, yeah, thanks. Have a good one.